The Justice Department Inspector General has released a harshly critical report about the FBI's handling of investigations into allegations of child exploitation. And this report identifies multiple ways in which the FBI is continuing to fall short in these types of investigations. This report is a follow-up to an earlier report by the same office about the FBI's errors during the investigation into former Michigan State gymnastics coach Larry Nasser. Nasser had been accused of sexual abuse by multiple of his female gymnasts. I find that you don't get it, that you're a danger. You remain a danger. The major takeaway from this report is that there is still more work for the FBI to do in terms of how it handles treats, processes, and investigates allegations of sexual misconduct against children. In particular, what this report found was that there were instances in which the FBI had failed to report allegations of misconduct against children to local law enforcement. One of the findings that really stood out is that the inspector general reviewed more than 300 cases between 2021 and 2023. And of those, it identified more than 40 that it said had not been adequately handled correctly. <laughs> In one episode, there was no investigative action that was taken for more than a year um, involving a claim of sexual abuse by a registered sex offender. And that was really startling. We got people here to escort you out whenever you take your time. There's no rush. There is a $2 million reward for information leading to his arrest and or conviction. A senior FBI official told reporters on a call that the FBI regards the investigations of crimes against children as a no-fail mission. And it says it really regards this work as, as significant and important work that the FBI has determined to get 100% right. The official said that um, mistakes were made and it acknowledges that, that the findings of, of uh, the Inspector General report, the FBI has accepted all of those uh, recommendations and conclusions. Um, and the FBI says it's going to continue to work to, to, to improve uh, its policies and, and procedures, including through training for agents and supervisors.